Hi, I'm Jordan Anderson, your host of Wired In at Roger Dean Chevrolet Stadium, brought to you by Omni Telecommunication, your source for up-to-date business technology. We'll be filling you in on what's been going on here at Roger Dean Chevrolet Stadium. We're coming to you from the busiest ballpark in the country, where we just wrapped up spring training. Tens of thousands of fans joined us for 30 Miami Marlins and St. Louis Cardinals games this season. Now the Florida State League is in full swing. You can come out and watch the Jupiter Hammerheads or the Palm Beach Cardinals all summer long. The Palm Beach Cardinals have had a great start to the season. With a 10-3 record, they're at the top of the Florida State leaderboard. Cardinals outfielder Justin Turner earned himself the title of FSL Player of the Week. He led the league with a 484 batting average and a 646 on base percentage in 47 plate appearances. After a slow start, the Hammerheads are gaining momentum. They're now 6-6 six six with the promising starting pitching rotation taking shape. Hammerheads pitcher Will Stewart had quite the remarkable performance on the mound in their April 12th game against the Lakeland Flying Tigers. The 21-year-old lefty took a no-hitter into the eighth inning and ended up only allowing one hit over seven and two-thirds innings. Let's take a look at what Stewart told us after the game. You know, I would be lying if I said I didn't know about the fourth inning whenever we didn't have any runs, no hits, and I had been through the lineup almost twice. I mean, I had I had a pretty good feeling about it, um, but I don't know. It was kind of weird because then we got deeper into the game and deeper into the game, and I started losing that thought in the back of my head of, wow, I could actually do this, and then it just kept going and going, and then I got to the eighth and gave up my hit, and I was like, hmm, there it is. I was like, I knew something was coming, but it was – the most incredible experience I've ever had, and it was pretty cool to do it with the Marlins. Awesome. If you're looking for some added fun for the family, come out to one of our weekly promotional nights. On Tuesdays, we host our Fins and Feathers Kids Club for kids 15 and under. Members get free admission to Tuesday games, a free hot dog and soda at Tuesday games, free admission to Cobb Theater, discounts at Golden Cub Mini Golf, Lighthouse Cove Mini Golf, and you get to rock this awesome t-shirt. Wednesdays, we host our Silver Sluggers Club. Our 55 and over fans get free admission and a free hot dog and soda at every Wednesday game with a membership. Things get a little competitive as our Silver Sluggers love coming out to play a game of baseball bingo each week. You'll find the best beer deal in town at our Let's Have a Party Thursdays. Attire Kingdom Red Cup gets you $1 domestic drafts and $2 crafts every Thursday all season long. Join us for some tail wagon fun on our Furry Fridays. Paying owners can bring their dogs into the stadium for free. On Sundays, we celebrate Hispanic culture at the ballpark with Fiesta Day Baseball. Mark your calendars because this Saturday, April 20th, is one of our biggest events of the year. It's our Easter candy drop presented by Wawa. A helicopter will be dropping candy into the outfield for kids to collect, and the Easter Bunny will be making a special appearance. Next Saturday, the 27th, is also a game you don't want to miss. We're teaming up with the Palm Beach Improv and some local breweries to bring you Brew Haha. Enjoy a two-hour craft beer tasting with over 75 unique flavors and a 45-minute comedy show. It'll be a Saturday filled with belly laughs, brews, and baseball. Tune in to Wired In each week to see what's going on here at Roger Dean Chevrolet Stadium. This has been Jordan Anderson with Wired In, sponsored by Omni Telecommunications, your source for up-to-date business technology.